Greetings. Earlier this week, I had a question uh, about one of the warm-up movements which helps us to kind of connect the upper and lower body through the shifting and turning of the weight as you're doing a movement. We do our step forward and punch exercise in the Tai Chi warm-ups. And when we do that movement, there's a little bit of rotation with your your center moving from side to side as the weight transfers. So I'll face uh, the camera so you can see uh, the feet start out evenly weighted with the fists by the hips. I'm gonna settle my weight into my right and I'm gonna turn off to my right just slightly as that weight settles over there. I'm gonna step out with my left. As the weight transfers forward, you'll see the center turns towards the front. Now the weight comes back and the body turns towards where the weight is. Then we'll bring the foot back. Now the weight's gonna transfer over to my left and I'll turn that way a little bit. Then as I shift forward again, the center turns towards the direction of the weight. So as I come back again, weight turn and back. So you can see that the weight moves side to side as you're doing the movement. And what you wanna try and go for is a feeling of shift turn. So when the weight transfers, then the body turns towards that direction so shift turn right, my right, shift turn left, shift turn right, shift turn left. As you can see it just goes back and forth side to side like that. Now this is an element of the forms that happens. We've got most of the movements where this uh, principle applies. There's some movements where you'll turn away from where the weight is going. Uh, but just a couple examples, for instance, as you do play the lute, you can see as my weight goes back, my body turns that way, and then it squares up a little bit. When we do the movements, you're going to connect your upper and lower body as you shift and turn from side to side. The most obvious one is cloud hands. You'll see that as the weight transfers, then the body turns. Again, as the weight transfers, the body turns. So you start the shift before the turn, but they are connected through the movement. So shift turn is a very, very common method to help you connect and coordinate your upper and lower body. Um, so you can keep that in mind with the different movements. Um, if you have questions about how that connects in class, just let me know. If you find these videos helpful, you can help contribute to them at patreon.com slash Thanks for watching.